many people think that the golden rule of friendship is that you can never, ever, ever date your friend's ex-boyfriend or girlfriend. But if their relationship is broken up, is it okay to break the rules? I'd like you to meet Chris. He says it is not okay. He says his best friend and business partner, Kevin, are they're very close, but things get heated when it comes to discussing Chris's ex fiance Lisa. Now, Chris, why is it difficult for you and Kevin to talk about Lisa? Because, first of all, she, I was with her, like, we was engaged for two, for two years. And we lived together. We shared a lot of things together. I share a lot of things with Kevin. I mean, we got, we're always in the studio. She's always in the studio. She's always with me. She was with me in the first place, and now she's going to be with him. We ain't going for it. That's going to interfere in our business relationship. And it's going to have a big impact on, what go, you know, how our financial situation is going to go. For him, maybe not for me too much, because I'm pretty much the production man behind the whole thing. Now, you said that you and Lisa were very tight. You were engaged at one time, right? Right. Why did the relationship break up? Well, she said because it was because I was always out in the studio. You know, always people beeping me all the time, calling on my cell phone, and I don't call right back. And she's thinking I'm with some other girl or something, you know, but it ain't really like that. I don't be with nobody. I'd be out in the studio taking care of business. So now... Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, can I... Ladies! <laughs> He was in the studio. He was paying the bills. No, Why don't y'all believe him? Now, I can understand, because I know a lot of my friends, the same things happen. Like, in this industry, it's like yeah. nothing but cutthroat. Everybody always trying to get with each other's girls and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So I told Kevin from the beginning, I ain't living like that. And we, we were partners before the production thing took off. Did you and have any idea that Kevin had eyes for Lisa? Not really. Not until, like, recently. But I always thought, so, you know, you always always looking at somebody else trying to check your girl out or how the conversation is going between another guy. Out. I would think so because of the way that she was like, she laughed with him and stuff. Like some guys uh -huh. in the studio, you know, and she don't be like with it. Like that crack a joke and it'd be funny as hell. I'd be laughing and everything, right? And she, she don't be quiet. laughing. But then when he crack a joke, it's like all funny and everything. I'm like, yo. <laughs> Lisa. Well, I, I really like didn't find out that I, you know, I ain't know, I ain't really know the real reason why I was coming here. I was always try to get things out in the open, you know. Yeah. I had heard in the midst, you know how it goes. You hear in the midst of everything, I but I wasn't certain. Too, so I said, I let me come here and see what the real is, and then I'm gonna let them know how wait, I feel wait, wait, about wait. it. I heard some things too, and I want everybody to hear what I heard. Kevin called in and recorded this message on our audio tape. So let's take a listen. But yo, check it out, I gotta make this brief Because you know what I'm saying, my boy might be on the downstairs phone You know what I'm saying, listening in First of all, my boy Chris got this ex fiance And seems to be interested in me And Chris is very jealous And for some reason, he's just not afraid to show it So what I want to do is tell him that it's over between them All right Let's hear from Kevin himself Kevin, come on out You know, business. Yeah, you, you know, all really boys, aren't you? I hear you're very, very funny. Well, you know, I try. I, I, <laughs> I hear you can tell a joke and just make Lisa crack up. Oh. You make me laugh sometimes, too. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>